So just before this video starts, my voice sounds really off because of a medical condition. Recently my vocal cords actually bled again, so if I sound like even more off than I usually do, then that's probably why. If it bothers you, then please click off. I don't really want hate, especially after I explained it in this part of the video, but if it doesn't really bother you, then I hope you enjoy. <laughs> So Mrs. Berkler, I see you've submitted an expression of interest for our student exchange program online. Yes, I think that would be so lovely for my darling Liana to get involved. She's always on her phone, so she'll get tons of social skills in this program. And you're aware of the cost, right? Of course, but it would be such a wonderful opportunity. There's only one other student in Westbrook High School going. You are also aware that Liana will be gone for six months? I've already read everything online, so I'm aware. Very well then. I'll let the school know once everything's been processed through, and we're all good to go. Oh my god, can you believe it's already been a year? Since what, Liana? Since Elliot bought his teddy bear to school and Rebecca put it on Facebook. Ew, that loser guy. Like, come on. Is he 18 or 8 months old? Oh, uh, you're too cuddly. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, Elliot, didn't your mommy also forget to give you diapers in a baby bottle? What? <laughs> Don't worry, I won't show anyone this video. Really? <laughs> I wasn't being serious. I'm putting this on Facebook where, let's see, the whole student body will see this. <laughs> oh my god, a crying boy. Loser, so weak. She totally destroyed him. It was so funny. That's why she's popular. And luckily, she doesn't hate us. You mean, she doesn't hate me. I mean, she kinda just likes you after you copied a phone case and everything, which is totally dumb. <sighs> I know, I didn't even intend on copying her. Can she get over it? Speak of the devil. Who, Rebecca? No, Elliot. If it isn't my favorite toddler boy, how are you, Elliot? <sighs> this is not happening. <sighs> isn't that video getting old yet? When it's on the internet, it stays there forever. Anyway, what do you want? Someone of my social status shouldn't be seen anywhere near people like you. Well, being honest, you really aren't that much better than me. I mean, after the whole drama of you and Rebecca over something as stupid as a phone case, Things got pretty ugly. So was it pretty? Or was it ugly? Oh, you know what I mean. <sighs> Do I? Well, the real reason why I came here is because the school office wanted me to give you the paperwork for the exchange program to Italy. <sighs> what exchange program to Italy? Is this a joke? They said something about your mum signing you up for this. No way. We're also the only students from our school going. Isn't that exciting? <sighs> Someone pray for me. Liana, do you want some holy water? I can easily get some. <sighs> oh, come on, Liana. I know you're excited. We're gonna be great friends after this. Walking around Italy, eating pizza. First off, I'm not going to Italy. And second of all, isn't that very stereotypical? But isn't this just so cool? Wow, I'm so happy that I forgot to smile. But we can totally put aside our differences. See you on the plane next week then, best friend. Liana, are you okay? Now really isn't a good time, Maisie. Just calm down, breathe. Oh, my mum will be in for this. How could you? Liana, please try to understand. Understand what? That you're shoving me off to Italy for the next six months? I guess you win the award of worst mother of the year. Liana, for dog's sake, mom. I don't even speak Italian. But you did it as a subject at school. Did you really think I paid attention in that class? <sighs> you are a terrible mother. How dare you speak to me like that? Besides, the Italian teacher at school was a total psychopath. I just think that you spend way too much time on your phone and a new environment will be healthy. I'm only buried in my phone because you're so boring, mom. Liana, I've already signed all of the paperwork. The decision has been made, so just accept it. I hate you. Liana, if you take one more step, I'm not gonna allow you to bring your cell phone on the trip. Oh yeah, try me.
all passengers Bye, boarding sweetie. flight 117. Have a good trip. This is your final call. Isn't this exciting? Here. Wait, what did she say? Well, are you serious? What do you mean? The first thing you do when you come to Italy is eat pizza. Isn't that kind of sad? I guess I'm getting into the mood. <sighs> Whatever. Also, weren't you wearing a pink shirt before? I changed on the plane. So what? Nothing. I just wanted to know why you had to change into a new outfit. Look, can we not talk about this now? I didn't even want to come on this trip in the first place. Quiet is still a problem. Andiamo. Wait, what do they say? Well, you're gonna have fun surviving for six months. You don't even know any Italian. <sighs> Just because you paid attention in that class. Anyway, where do we go? We were supposed to meet someone in this park. Ciao. Um, what did she say? Ooh, sorry. My English and Italian aren't fantastic. I'm French. My name is Sophie. I will be the coordinator for this exchange program. Great. Elliot, we have a French woman showing us around and being the coordinator in Italy. What kind of program did my mom sign me up for? Ooh, I'm sorry, but I would love to show you around. Follow me. This is the villa that we will be staying in. Wait, we? We, oui, we! Oui. You two are new to Italy, so I must stay with you. Ah, uh, I didn't think this trip could get any worse. You know what? My life is ruined anyway, so just move. Okay. I can't do this. Liana? What? Come on, talk to me. No. Uh. I can do what I want. What's wrong? This place is a mess. You don't find it the least bit suspicious that we have a French woman taking us around Italy? And on top of that, I did not want to come in the first place. My mum made me. And we had to stay in this villa with that woman for six months? Just give it some time. You might really enjoy it here. Don't talk to me. You sound like my mum. Liana! I'm done! Ouch! I'm so done with this! Are you okay? I'm fine! Your nose! Let's get you cleaned up. Why did my mom sign me up for this? I hate this! Le pazza! I can't even interact with anyone here! <laughs> what the? Oh my god, the step ladder to the pool fell. Someone, we need help. They don't speak English. The step ladder. It's too heavy. It's okay, little one. You're safe with me. Oh my god, she's not breathing. <coughs> Easy there. You're gonna be okay. Alessia. Grazie. Um, you're welcome. Plenty quest up per notizia. What's going on? What is this? Liana. What's up with you? It's been three months. The news of me saving that girl wasn't even over yet. How is this possible? I don't know. Everywhere I go, someone takes a photo of me for the news. <laughs> you look great with the contacts, by the way. Oh, thanks. But I guess there's really only one more solution if you want to stop all of this attention. What is it? You have to go home early and quit this exchange program. 
I don't know. Didn't you want to go home? Yeah, I did, but it's been three months. This is kind of like my life now. Of course, it's always your decision. I don't know. Oh. I'm past people. I, I don't. Elliot, I'm going home. So, eventually I went home. My mum became sympathetic after she realised what happened. Elliot stayed in Italy, but that's how life goes. I guess this behaviour in mine set us apart from other people, him back home here, and me in Italy. But after everything that's happened, I guess I'm not classified as a misfit. <laughs>